The storm coverage you expect is the coverage we deliver. We're in weather alert mode. Very intense thunderstorms, especially in Tallinn. No one here has power. With cutting-edge technology. Very powerful dual-pole Doppler. This is a very good tool. And a team of professionals keeping you informed and safe. This road is closed here. Well, that could be hail the size of a quarter. All day on all your screens. Download our app on your mobile device. When severe weather strikes, we are everywhere. Early warning weather on Eyewitness News. It's that tiny. When your doctor says, that's where she'd go. When other hospitals need help. When it matters most, turn to Hartford Hospital. It's that time of year again. And today's lesson, my untouchable back-to-school values. Like my Bobopedic 9 Twin Extra Long Mattress. Sleep like a genius for only $2.99. Every student needs a desk. Get my trait with rustic wire brush finished. Or my Chadwick in three colors, each only $1.99. My Austin dresser, mirror, nightstand, and queen headboard, all for only $6.99. Class dismissed. Good morning, everybody. All right, we do have a heat advisory in effect for Southern Fairfield County. This uh, makes it feel, it's gonna, the temperature's going to get into the low 90s, but it'll feel a little bit warmer than that with the combined relative humidity. So uh, it's going to feel a little bit warmer in Southern Fairfield County. Also an air quality alert in effect from 11 to 11. This is for those of the very sensitive categories, the very young, the very old, those with respiratory problems, health ailments, asthma, so you want to seek the air conditioning today. Channel 3 early morning radar scanning dry. That's the way it's expected to stay until this evening. So it's clear and warm to start. Hot and humid this afternoon. Showers and thunderstorms roll in tonight, and some of those could pack a punch. So the Storm Prediction Center out of Norman, Oklahoma, has placed Connecticut in the marginal risk category for severe weather this evening through very early tomorrow morning. Highs today will climb into the low 90s. Another hot day. Today will be day three of the 90-degree heat, thus making an official heat wave. Tomorrow could be day four. Saturday could be day five. The heat is with us. 7.58 is now the time to close up next with traffic. Now, early morning pinpoint traffic, driven by your Connecticut Chevy dealer. All right, good morning, everyone. Right now, just want to give you a quick update. Literally, the wreckers just pulled away here in Hartford on 84 eastbound by exit 50. There was a breakdown. It was pushed off to the shoulder, but it was in kind of a rough area uh, just because, obviously, you see cars flying around the corner here, and it was literally sitting on an incline. But nonetheless, it is gone, so you don't have to worry about it. Uh, we do have a two-car crash that literally just took place. This just came into our pinpoint traffic center. 95 northbound right between exits 43 and 44. The left lane is closed in that area. If you are taking the trains, good news, Metro North and Shoreline East, both running on or close to schedule at this time, so you won't run into any issues on the tracks. That is your Connecticut Chevy pinpoint traffic report driven by your Connecticut Chevy dealers. Enjoy your day. It's important to raise our children.